The amount of times I've had people come up to me, you don't know French? You want some? No photo. Why do you want a photo? I don't know French. <laughs> What's the worst thing that's happened to you because of your fame? Being knocked out, I think. Uh, yeah, when I got knocked out, when I'd run for the bus, this Sparto knocked out. This was about six, seven months after the video first came out. It's not nice to wake up in an ambulance and find out you've got a bleed on the brain. Which very I was very surprised at that time. I didn't even think I had a brain. <laughs> they managed to find something there anyway, so... And that is the downside of it. Yeah, I've not had any uh, physical violence, but like... It wouldn't with a big boy like <laughs> <laughs> But when I go out on nights out and stuff, if someone catches wind of it, Jesus Christ, like, they'll be like, hey, fish and a rice cake, fish yeah. boy. Talking to a girl online and then them finding out that I'm fishing a rice cake and them just never speaking to me again. <laughs> so what do you that, find out? You don't have plenty of fish? I'm not on plenty of fish, no, I've not tried that one. <laughs> plenty of fish and wife tape. <laughs> oh, no, he's shredding me. <laughs> I tell you what, the amount of times I've had people come up to me, you don't know French? You want some? <laughs> no photo. <laughs> Why do you want a photo? I've got no friends. <laughs> How do the public react when they see you on the street? Well, I'm lucky enough that I don't look anything like I did when I was 16, which I don't think anyone really does, do they? So it, it's kind of when people know, find out it's me, which normally is on like Facebook or something, yeah. they type Danny Andrews. They'll be like, oh, are you the fish and rice cake guy? And I'm like, oh, no, because then they've got a preconceived idea of what you are yes. before they've even met you. So they think that I'm just a, a, a stupid 16-year-old when I'm a, like a 30-year-old man. Like, I'll get people that come into my barber shop that know, know fine well that I'm the fish and rice cake guy, and I can feel them setting it up to say, yeah. Yeah. and they're going, so uh, you, you, do, do you train? Because I don't go to the gym. I'm like, no. And then they're like, um, so you don't go to the gym anymore? And then it's the first time they've been in for a haircut. I just know that they're dying to just say fish and a rice cake. And then... When they sometimes give you like shit about it, it, it's like it's the first time that like, it's like, oh, yo, it's been like yeah. how many years? It's been 14 yeah. years and they're going to me, fish and a, hey, fish and a rice, uh, fish and a rice. And I'm like, oh, I've had 14 years of this. Like, it's, they're acting like it's the first time that someone's ever said it to me. So it's like when I'm just like rolling my eyes, it's hard, isn't it, to be, yeah. do you know what, some days when you probably, you're not, when you're tired and you can't be a I bet it's annoying when people start going, you got no fans, do you know, oh, stuff. Really? Is there ever times when you get annoyed at it? At the end of the day, people don't know your mood. So you've just got to be a normal everyday person. Try and make them people happy. Yeah, yeah. And... So do you never get it in a negative way? Like, do people not, like... People not say, is it always positive when they, they say no, it to you? No, you still get the negative. And how do you react to that? Do you just, just ignore them? Smile. Smile. They want a reaction of you. Right, so then, they'll turn around, put it on social media, I met the Wolf Stone Raider, he was all right, beep, full, full of himself. If you smile at them, yes sir, no sir. That's why the trolls, I just, when they troll me, I give them a little happy face. That winds them up even more. They want you to react. So then, they got a story out of nothing. Yeah. So, just smile. How did you feel, like, about like the people mocking you, like the negative comments and stuff? It did upset me. Some, there's some horrible people out there, really horrible people. First of, all, first of all, I weren't used to it. If you've got nothing better to do than sit on a t t board and insult people, you're not worth lying about in the first place, are you? No. Really? no. Sound interesting? Well, some of them are quite funny. Like yeah. they say like, oh, like there'll be some, quest there'll be some uh, comments saying like, I thought fish was brain food. Obviously yeah. not. Yeah. Um, there was other one saying that my shirt's like an old caravan curtain. But well, people are like proper passionate about, about, about how they feel about me when they've watched a, a 10 second clip of me when I was 16 years old yeah. and that, that kind of gets to me. But I just try not to read them because I just think, oh, there's no, same that, same there's no, that. There's no point. Yeah. Yeah, 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 it's not worth it. No. What's the point of upsetting yourself? Yeah, yeah, that's what I do now, yeah. and I, I understand that there will be, there's always going to be negative. Yeah. I'd like to say there's some positives, but there, there, there generally isn't on my videos. <laughs>